Your old dad has given us a mission. It seems the Romer encampment. Now, if we remember clearly, this is modern day. And if I could put all the puzzle pieces together, and that I have. Oh, we had the fucking magic carpet on that way here. I fucking knew it. Okay. It sounds like Maribel won't be coming with us for a while, I hope. Lady Maribel's place is by her father's side. We must continue our journey without her. Ruff's upset. He gets to be upset. I don't blame him, man. Maribel's our friend, and it's unfair for her because her fucking dad is a stupid motherfucker. I mean, I'd be worried sick too, but I would at least try to, like, think of my, my fucking child's, <laughs> child's wishes and make myself not ill worrying by them. I would still worry, but not worry them to fucking death. Like, that's just disrespectful. That's me just being disrespectful to my own children. <coughs> right there. Here we are. Look at this. Shh, please do not talk to me now. I am watching Ashy dance. The way she moves, it 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 really does something to me. Ashy. Okay. Now let's all pause for a minute. And yes, there's a mini metal. I just randomly grabbed it. But let's think about this for a minute. Now, the last time we were in this sort of thing... I believe we left a certain Prince of Estud behind. Now, if he was the Guardian, right? And his beloved, the sexy, big-titted... Lala, with her Lala's, right? They would have had kids, correct? So going with this trend, now you get to see where we're going with here. Now you see where I'm kind of hinting here. If Kiefer had to... <laughs> with Lala, he would have left a descendant behind. But not only that, he knows that we're in the present. So leaving his descendant to help us on our journey is almost very seriously way too fucking convenient to be honest with all of you oh me treat okay um i believe register this is a um, thing for like a monsters for specific monsters which i've already fucking slaughtered and i'm sorry I was trying to find the fucking mini metals, and I ended up killing every single one of those monsters. <sighs> and this is why he's upset with me. Okay. Let's look down on my thing here. Okay, there was one. So we got that. So we don't have to worry about it. God, Jose. Eh? We don't get many of, many of you visiting. Ordinarily, we go, we would go out of our way to give you a warm welcome, but we are right in the middle of one of our most important rituals at the moment. Would you mind waiting for a short while? The legends tell that the altar of the Almighty lies on the other side of the mountains, to the west of here. But you must have seen there is nothing but open sea. Does that mean the legends are wrong? Could the ancient tomes be mistaken? Your travelers, yes? It is a pleasure to meet the fellow nomads. Although I am not sure we will be able to call you ourse call ourselves that if we do not move camp soon. I am beginning to miss the thrill of the road. You have to talk to every single villager. How long is Rombaro planning on keeping us camped here? We have not found the lake which is said to contain the altar. Waiting here will not change that fact. You agree with me in this regard, yes? Of course. To be honest, I'm beginning to question whether the altar even exists.
we've seen that altar. We Romer set on a journey many centuries ago and have remained on the move ever since. During the Demon King's reign of terror, we had to remain mobile in order to escape his clutches. Now that he is no more, the purpose of our journey is to seek what which the altar is to said that the Almighty is sealed away. We Romers treat our dancers, our, cho our chosen ones, with great respect. Ashi will be the tenth to have borne this honor. No, not all are created equal, of course. Word has it that Lala, the second of the dancers, was truly special. Ashi, however, she is a difficult prospect. The honor of having have been chosen to sit uneasily with her. Mm -hmm. So this Ashy girl kind of has character traits of her great, 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 five great grandfather, Kiefer. Yeah, because they had a grandpa, which grandmother, which one of them the sixth, her mother the seventh, and her being the tenth. So a nine. So which means yeah, Kiefer <coughs> most likely would have had effects <coughs> on this outcome. I see. Yes, we have to talk to everyone before the cutscene happens again. I hate this about this game. You, like, oh, you gotta talk to everyone before the amazing cutscene comes. I'm like, fuck you. So they don't have a turban player. This is where this, this side quest is going to be fucking long, my boys. It's going to be long, my dudes. Now let's talk to him. Yep, we had to talk to everybody in the camp. I'm afraid that the ritual is not yet over. You have to wait. Hmm? Sounds like they all finished, but why so much earlier that... Ashy, wait, the ritual... It has not yet been completed. What just happened? Rumbaro? Oh. Dear Christ. Sick, man. No, don't put it in my bag. Put that in my bag. Put you in my bag. Put this in my bag. Put that in the bag. That could be used for later. In ancient times, humanity managed to escape the clutches of the Demon King and survive to live in peace thanks to the efforts of a band of heroes. Alas, this peace will not last. The Demon King will return to torment this world once more. That is why we roamers must fulfill our duty. We must restore the Almighty. But I cannot be the dancer who brings the, that about. I must pass the torch to the next generation. To Ashi. Ah, uh, you are the guests, yes? I apologize for the difficult scene you had to witness. I do not know what Ashi objected to strongly. Perhaps it was the fact that I was playing the turban. Or perhaps the younger generation simply do not appreciate... How much of an honor it is to be chosen as the clan's dancer. I don't think she wants to be the clan's dancer. Ah. Uh. 
Dude, she did not want to be the fucking dancer. I can tell you right now. But she laughed, and she's probably pissed. So let's go try to talk to her in the next video. See you guys later.